guys welcome back to my channel so I gained about 36 pounds when I was pregnant with my little one so um, my plan was to after I have him it was to like fast for like two weeks right away um, and then start to work out once the six week hit um, but obviously you can't do that when you're breastfeeding you actually have to eat more so that wasn't a real option and I wasn't gonna risk um, not being able to produce for him so I wanted to continue to eat I just wanted to eat better um, and just so you know with my pregnancy I did not work out and I did not have a strict diet um, I mean I was cognizant of like not doing so much to where I would end up like you know having diabetic pregnancy I also kind of like gave into my cravings like as much as I wanted to so um, I ate all of the fried chicken okay all of the pizza all of the burgers in and out burger to be exact um but yeah i just kind of indulged in all those things as much as i wanted to so yes yeah, so i gained 36 pounds with that pregnancy which i believe they say it's pretty typical that you would gain about 30 to 35 pounds if i'm not mistaken like i said it's been a long time okay so <laughs> okay so I am currently eight weeks postpartum, a few days over eight weeks postpartum. I told myself I was going to get a fitness belt that would help me to kind of sweat it out, lose the water weight, and just kind of slim in my waist as much as possible. So, I bought the J-Sculpt. Yay! There is the J-Sculpt. I've been wanting this for a while. Um, okay, so I think it was listed at $59.99 and there was a gold 25 discount code or something and I used that and I still spent about $59, $58, something like that on the, with the shipping. So it was kind of a discounted, but with the shipping it still came out to be the same amount. Um, I haven't put this on yet. I was waiting until I could sit down or stand up and do this with you guys. So that means I'm going to be very vulnerable today and show this waist area this whole situation which is you know it's a lot <laughs> so bear with me so anyways here it is so let's take it out this is the package that it came in and just the shipping bag and i wanted to mention too um when you go onto the website to order your waist belt um, and I watched a ton of videos first just to be sure because I was trying to decide between this one and the Keisha Kaor. Honestly, the two things that made me decide this between the Keisha Kaor belt, and I don't have any very like expensive belts or anything, so this was my first time kind of purchasing. No, actually it wasn't. I did order the, um, gosh, what was the belt? I'm, if I can remember what it was called, I'm going to put it um, on the screen. But I ordered that belt, I want to say after I had my second son after i had east side so back in 2012 i ordered this belt and I, I thought it was great but it was very very stiff like it really stitched you in you know and it was really popular at the time too but someone stole it so all the videos that i watched they basically said you don't want to size down thinking like oh this is just like any other belt that you just want to you're going to just pull and pull and you're going to stretch yourself stretch it so you can fit yourself into it this belt is not going to do that so they're basically like no do exactly what the website says the website will tell you to put in your waist measurements so you just need a little like flimsy tape measure and put that waist in put your waist measurement in and then it asks if your hips are two inches or more larger than your waist which yes very much so so i wanted to give it some more time for my body to kind of like just do what it was going to do naturally first before i um ordered the belt and i wanted to make sure i would get a size that i could use for a while and not have to like reorder within the next couple weeks so this is the large well this is pretty much it it's definitely like the rubber material that everyone's kind of saying i mean it does have that like very rubber smell or a neoprene, I'm not sure what, this is not neoprene. This is something else. Okay, so it's all latex. 96% cotton and 4% spandex, but latex inside. So inside, inside is all latex. Um, so yeah, this is what it looks like. It does look a little small, but let me just tell you right now, what I know for sure is this is not gonna give. <laughs> I'm running out of time. <laughs> so let's try to make this fast, but this is the belt. So it is a zipper. Grab some scissors and clip this before I try it on. But this is what it looks like. It's a zipper con 
construction. This is what it looks like inside. It just has the little tag right here. It says large. I don't know if you'll ever see it, but we'll see. And then of course, this. Oh, whoa. that's really adorable. Um, Velcro. So now I'm gonna try it on for you guys. Bear with me. Okay, there's a kid in trouble. Just ignore that. Finally got it on. You guys, this was so hard. Like I had to just turn the camera off because you no, know, it was just too much. But you can still see like kind of my bulge, but it's definitely sucking me in. You can see it's like got my waist together. And now I'm gonna do the other part. <laughs> By the way, I have to have my son help me. He's not happy about it. Like at all. <sighs> okay. I got it on. It's all that matters. And then I would just pull this back up. Whew. So I'm not uncomfortable down here. It's really just sucking me all the way in. Like I don't feel like pain. I just feel like sucked in, you know? Anyways, but look, I have like this whole, <laughs> should have got the extra. <laughs> I should have got the extra large. <laughs> this is so funny, actually. <laughs> Anyways, I have this one now, so I'm not even gonna stress about it. <sighs> okay, where you get? Where's you guys back up? <laughs> okay, so honestly, I think when I had my other children, I was just younger, and so my body was like, you know, just right back. Snap back to it, you know? And this is just different. And I, I actually, I feel different. I feel like I'm a little sad about it actually, but it just is what it is. Let me see if I can bring this back down some and then maybe take it out or stand back some so you can kind of see. But this is the gist right now. And again, I have a really, really short torso. So I'm feeling this like up into my, like, you know, it's like pushing up my backpack. <laughs> see, and then it's all gathered. I feel like I don't see anybody else's gathered like this. I don't think that it's made to fit, you know, everyone exactly the same. All right, so as you can see, I have it on, and I mean, I feel really sucked in, and I feel really good, but getting it on was such a hassle. Like, I was just gonna try it on and take it off. But no, I'm gonna keep this on for the rest of the day. And it will remind me to eat salad, less dressing, less croutons. Hey. You will not believe what I'm doing. Wait, 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 wait what? Are you working out? Yeah, well, kind of. I see the sheen, I see the sheen. Uh, I was putting on this waist belt. Oh, nice. Look at that. Pull it in, Jesus. Listen, this belt. <laughs> I am so. I can't even put it on by myself. I have to have you nice help me. I got the size that they told me to get. I'm like hot. I zipped up my. He zipped up my belly. At one point, my I got a zip. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I think you're supposed to put a tank top on under it, girl. Really? No, I've seen other people put the, the put this on, and even the person who, the girl whose company it is, she puts it on with no, but no, nothing on her, but like some Abilene or something. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Just, <laughs> I'm recording. <laughs> oh shoot. <laughs> 
<laughs> I, I, 